uh, getting a little oversaturated at my main. So, yeah. Just getting there. Not seeing a whole lot. I see the Twilight Council. Um, so I can kind of assume he's getting Zealot Charge. That's really good against Marauders. But even so, if I have a Concussive Shell and even Stim, I can still micro around it and win. I really think Protoss needs to go Heavy Immortal with Charge Lot in order to, to beat uh, Terran Bio. And uh, even like Immortal Colossi will rip through Marines and Marauders. At this point, I see that he's attacking this, and I, I cancel it. And uh, watching my minimap is probably how I avoid taking a lot of losses here. I lose like one SCV. I'm just going to stim and destroy this. He has a really bad position at this point. Um, but a nice try at a sneak, a sneak attack right there. If I wasn't paying attention, he could have taken out a lot of stuff. I do have the area behind my minerals pretty blocked off with the supply depots. You can see him on the minimap, my third expansion is going down right, right there. And I'm taking out the rocks for the gold. Because once again, I've taken out one of those armies. And when you do that, you don't need to attack and kill him. Because sometimes, I mean, the closer you get to his base, the faster he's going to be able to reinforce. And if you try and just kill him, it's sort of a coin flip a lot of the time. So it's generally just better to cement your advantage by taking more expansions. And that's what I'm doing. Meanwhile, I'm going to send my army over to the watchtower and send one marine over to the other watchtower to gain complete control. <coughs> uh, okay, and should be re-hotkeying some of these buildings. I see some of them are not hotkeyed. There we go, that's better. And making a lot of uh, stuff, a lot of workers. I need to transfer a lot of these guys because that's just way too many workers right there. And um, actually supply blocked right now. Do I notice that? I believe that I will. But I'm quite low on money, which is pretty impressive. I'm happy about being low on money. Now at this point I see his army moving in. Watching my mini-map is how I saw that and reacted so quickly. Um, I'm going to move them in here to defend my expansion. And I do leave some guys in the watchtower still. I don't want to lose that watchtower. <clears throat> and I really want to engage that army because I feel like I can, I can kill it. But he is actually doing a great job of just pressuring, picking off units, and moving back. And um, that's going to be pretty tough for me. Uh, I see that he does not have the gold yet, which already puts me pretty far on the lead. Um, I really, I think I should be scouting those other expansions with SCVs. I'm not doing that. i got to work on that in the future. Also, notice how low in health a lot of my army is. Uh, I need to get medivacs, like really badly. If you have stim, you kind of need medivacs. Um, so in the future, I need to get a faster starport. Or one at all. <laughs> anyway, um, now he is moving in, and I just need a micro against the charge lots, and I should be okay. Uh, as good as they are, you really need large... I mean, look how big my army is. You need larger numbers of charge lots to deal with that. Anywho. Um... All right, now I'm, yeah, I'm going to try and throw down a f uh, fourth base. And I th think I should have just floated my main over there instead of actually building another one, but whatever. And not actually watching the battle here. More important to, to take care of stuff at my base. And at this point, it's the game is won. So, I hope you enjoyed watching. Uh, not a lot of decision making in this game, it, it was pretty straightforward, but um, you can maybe tell how I'm macroing during battles, and how I'm watching the minimap and scouting a bit. Anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed, thanks for watching, bye.